that same night. Okay, so that's what we do. Mmm. Wow. Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today, yeah, today I'm back with another reaction video because Pink Courtroom dropped a new episode. But I'm feeling myself today because like my hair is up and I feel like, I feel like you're in and woke up and threw her hair in a messy bun. Like, you see it? You see it? I know you see it. Okay, for real. Oh, this is my favorite car. So what? Tattoos are cool. She look mad though. Please be seated. Court is now in session. So can we have our case for today? Thank you. The nails are too long. As she says. So we are here today in the Her office. Nice room. too. What's going on? I'm scared. Has brought the defendant for an alleged theft and deceit. So the claimant is requesting the defendant to reimburse the value of her jacket and an apology. So let's get a crack in. <laughs> so a jacket? Claimant, can you state your name for the record, please? My name is Claudia. And defendant, can you state your name for the record, please? Ray. Ray. Okay. okay. So before we get into no, it, we're going to be advised to take a pink courtroom photograph. So if you'd like to pass it to our friends over there, they can understand. Alright, so Claudia, repeat after me. Ray, repeat after me. I, Claudia. I, Claudia, swear to tell the truth. Swear to tell the truth. And nothing but the truth. And nothing but the truth. In the pink courtroom. Is she okay? In the pink courtroom. No matter how, how messy, messy it may be. Ish. No, no matter how messy, messy it may be. be. <laughs> okay. You both present your opening statements to the court, and then after, Judge Nella and I will give, you know, our opinions on the statements that we've heard. With okay? a series of questions. Yeah. Period. Claudia, I'll use bus. Okay. Put it in the simplest way possible. Oh, wait. Listen, it's burning my chest at this point. Uh -huh. I was a good friend. She was a friend. Best oh. way to put it. We went okay. on the night out. She was cold because she didn't bring a jacket. I lent her my jacket. Next thing I know, the bitch has gone with my jacket and my card inside. Spent money on my card. This is the principle, bro. Why are you taking my jacket and spending money off my card? If you're broke, you can just tell me I'll send you some money. That's fine. <laughs> I'm here for my jacket and my money and emotional support money. Emotional support yeah. money for a jacket. Yeah, for a jacket. <laughs> Listen, the trauma I've been through. That was my favorite PLT jacket. They're out of stock now. What am I supposed to do? You mean you should shop my collection? That's right. Okay. okay. Ray, do you have anything to say about that? Realistically, she was absolutely burst. She sold me her jacket. I gave it right back to her. This girl was taking shots and shots with a Drake sang a song for her. Shot for me was not made for you. Furthermore, I gave the jacket back to her. She was so drunk that she went home with her jacket, clearly lost it along the way, or I don't know, left it in the club. I don't know what she was on. I just like that the jacket. Can I ask? Can I ask you lots of time? Can I go, is that your jacket? Is this the jacket? Did no, you the that, that's, Imagine. That's not the jacket. <laughs> the audacity. I want to run the jacket. I can't. <laughs> Suction. Where I'm a little bit confused, yeah. Cal, you're saying that you lent her the jacket. Yeah. But Ray, you're saying that's not true. She lent me the jacket. I'm saying I gave it back to her before I left. I gave her the jacket in the smoking area because she was cold. Next thing I know, she's disappeared. It would have been fine, but the fact that the card was in the jacket and she went and spent money off the card tells me that she was trying to thieve. If she just wanted to go home in the jacket, that's fine. Do you remember how you got home that night? Yeah, I had Apple Pay on my phone, so I ordered myself a Uber. I couldn't use my card because someone took it. So you were, you know, you were sober enough to get yourself to home. To get myself home, home. yeah. That's... Of your surroundings yeah. that was going on. Yeah. Also, she was having the same amount of drinks I was because I was paying to her. <laughs> How are you so sure yeah, that she actually stole your jacket? Because you actually gave it to her. Oh, with sorry. consent. You was in the smoking area. Everybody in that smoking area is hot because you lot are baking off. So let's be real. You took it off because you were sweating and then you gave it to her and then she gave it back to you and now you're complaining that what? I just feel like there's some inner beef. Like, you, know you guys what? cannot be beefing over a jacket. What uh, really so is the problem? Essentially, Obviously the beef isn't about the jacket, but at the same time, um, if I gave you my jacket and all of a sudden, funds are missing on my card that was in my jacket um yeah i'm trying to think like like I'm, if she was sober enough to order herself an uber whoop, 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 get home i don't think she was like so gone that she just got her jacket back and lost it like 
but they definitely have some underlying issues. I'm excited to dive into that. The reason I even left that motive was because I saw my ex guy still might be sleeping with here and there on the side, right? A few days later after this party, I get a Snapchat from my ex saying, come and get your jacket. I did not go to this man. <laughs> That's a cherry on top. Girl, <laughs> uh, now you might as well just confess because now you're just like literally making it sound even more. Helicopter, helicopter. But no, now you're really just making it sound more suspect. What are you talking about? Her man has the type of girls with that jacket. That doesn't even make sense. The jacket though. But, 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 but I gave it back. But I left the what, what, what? You but I gave it back. had the jacket. But I gave it back. Before I left the car. You're I don't believe her. I think she's sleeping with her ex. So. Her ex, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Her ex, her ex. 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 Her ex, Secure, secure. I don't even want you involved right. in this. Right, let's, can let's yourself. Group, group. Claudia, do you have evidence for the money that was spent on your heart? I've got plenty of evidence. I've got bank statements, I've got screenshots, I've got the whole thing. I think we'd like to see it. Definitely. We'd like to see it. Please hand on the wrong. Whose jacket is this? Mine. That's my jacket on the floor. Like a piece of rubbish. So do you think this man Rachel really is leaving your belongings on the floor? Hold on, but if she took and the jacket, the then she left it, you know? Has a situation like this between you and Ray ever happened in the past? Not to this scale. Oh, but I, I have told yourself. her before that I oh. like a guy and then she oh. went and lived in that same night. Okay, so that's what we do. Mmm. Wow. I'm gonna skip over the part where you f my ex five years ago and I allowed it. I oh! Wow! Wow! Oh, wow! That was. Oh. Mm. You brought me to court for this man. Right, we're gonna move on swiftly, okay? Yeah, um, <laughs> I think it's clear what's happening here. You guys are not friends and you sleep with each other's man's exes now, talking stages, whoop de whoop. Yeah. So, this bank statement. Oh, so, we've got on Wednesday, the 27th of January, £35 was spent at a bar and grill. Which is where you guys were? And then we have £35 at Big Tesco. I'm vegan as well. And then thirty pounds on a black cab. Babe, you did that. That's how you got your cab home. Literally, how? So you, you said you bought the drinks, right? It says bar and grill. So you bought the drinks. Then afterwards, you were burnt. So you went to Tesco to get some snacks. And then you got a black cab and you went home. I she didn't spend your money. You spent your money. You don't remember. No one wants her ex. He looks like he snuck onto you earth. <laughs> Yeah, I think they just feel sleeping with each other's mans. I, I think that's the problem. Convinced that this jacket at your ex house belongs to you. Yeah. How do you how do you want to get this back? Why would you not just pull your ex and ask for it back? Well, no, this is the thing. After that picture was sent, I went to his house. And, and the jacket the was there without the bank card. So I'm not just going to pick up the jacket when, in reality, what I care about is the bank card. How do you know your ex since still your bank card? He's your ex. That's so true. Go, 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 go. And he's a man. So, Ray, what evidence did you bring with you to court today? The evidence I have with me is on the iPad, and it's her off her face. She don't look that burst. Yeah. He looks more burst than her. Oh, oh. I've been f***ing normal size. I would have been so out. See, it's a normal size shot. Have you seen the cut? Cheers! Just set track and the vision's getting clearer. She's done with that job. Right, yeah. Stay, stay. Just having a good time. Right, let's look at another one here. Having a good time. Mm. It's a TikTok. Oh, sorry. It's a TikTok. I don't. So we got Claudia explaining. 
thinking how mash up she wants. Did y'all roll about last night? I thought you were going to remember what's I don't know, like stop being friends and stop stop sleeping with each other's man. That's all I have for this episode. Guys, so I think I've heard enough. I wanna hear a closing statement from each of you before me and Jaja make our deliberation. So Claudia, would you like to go first? Keep yeah. it short and sweet. No interruptions, please. Got you. Thank you. Short and sweet. She stole my jacket, she stole my car, she stole my man. Principle of our friendship, she took the piss. I would like a public apology on her Instagram story. Compensation back for the money that she spent. And also extra money for emotional damages because she's caused me a lot of trouble. Because not only did I lose my ex, I also now lost my best friend. Boom, bow, drop, bow. I need to write this down. Oh, okay. Damn it, honey. But you slept with her ex five years ago. <laughs> and I know it's not tip for tap, but like... <laughs> I know it's not tip for tap, but for me, it has to be tip for tap. If you do something to me like very specific like that, the only way we can remain friends is if I get my leg back. And if not, I'll have to part away. So, <laughs> Okay, we would you like to provide us with a closing statement for the court? Honestly, I don't really have too much to say. No one needs her jacket. No one needs her man. No one needs her bank card. Listen. If you're going to go back to your ex, it happens, innit? We all do that. We all do that. But she's been there six years now. Do you know how many times this man's cheated on her? I'm not surprised she's paranoid. I'm not surprised she's paranoid. It's about a jacket. It's about a jacket. It's about a jacket. It's about a jacket. Thank you. Yeah, back to your seats. Me and Judge India are going to deliberate. Thank you. Can you just move, man? Coffee, stupid. Oh, there's my favorite part. So, what? I don't know. Do you think we're going to have to What do they have in common? Both delusional. He's giving, um, he's not even my type, he's broke. He says, but he was in the back of his car doing my f and my f and spreading yeah, so let's be real. Fight over man. They fight over man, so there's no girl could. Claudia wants a hundred pounds plus emotional damage. Emotional damage for a man that you've been going back to for six years. He needs to pay the emotional damage. Do you know what I mean? This whole story don't make sense. They're both in the wrong. Yeah, but like, I just don't know if I had sex with her or Bro, after a motive, yeah? You call your favorite sighting. You, oh, sorry, damn it. But like, after a motive, you call, you call your favorite boyfriend, and then you're like, oh, babe, like, come pick me up, and then he picks yeah, you up, and then. Yeah, but her favorite boyfriend is her best friend's ex. <sighs> What's wrong with you, bro? Are you two okay now? She's fine Just out. look. We don't appreciate how you walked out for that. Don't storm off in the pink courtroom. You wait to be dismissed, okay? Apologies, Jana. I'm not gonna lie. I'm trying to be messy. I'm trying to hear from the audience. Guilty or not mm, guilty? Not guilty. guilty. <laughs> not guilty. She slept with her ex five years ago. She got her like that. <laughs> Ray, do you find Ray to be guilty or not guilty for theft and deceit? Everyone's thinking, like, Ree, you're, you're, you're looking guilty still. But at the end of the day, it's me and the internet make the decision. Do you get me? That's why it's our pink courtroom yep. and not theirs. But thanks for the contribution. Okay? <laughs> After all the deliberation, we've come to our conclusion. In the case of Claudia versus Ray, me and DJ think that you are first. Idiotic. Page 3.2, all the way half down, it says that you should never, never, never break the girl code. Mm -hmm. Your hands are mine, and everything that you say, you are mine. Mm -hmm. And you're out here spreading her business, it's saying that she spread her yash like pavement. That's mad. That's very, very mad. And for you to bring. And I don't know why we're all forgetting, and she slept with her ex five years ago. Your friend to call over, man. 
bro, you could have FaceTimed, you could have called each other. You're bringing your, your friend to, go, to come and say that she's friends and yet she's one of all these strangers on national YouTube. That's very weird. Based on the evidence and me and Judge Lowe's decision, we have sentenced you, Ray, to 25 years, no parole, yeah? Claudio, not off easy. We have 12 months of community service in Peckham. Do you know what? I'm not I like Peckham, right. Peckham so I'm yeah. not going to complain. Broad waterfowl, that's where you're going to be sweeping up um, uh, 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 trash. Today's learning in the pink courtroom is basically don't violate, don't violate girl. Because I'm not going to lie, you guys coming in here screaming at each other over man just makes you bear down. And it's like, these are your priorities. Like, these are actually your priorities. A jacket and cab money. You guys went to the park and yeah, from, from the bar and grill. You guys didn't even go uptown. You went to the bar and grill around the corner. Let's, come on. Like, don't violate the girl because then both of you look dumb. Like, come on, it's, 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 I was going to say bros before hers, but it's, it's, Chicks before d Chicks before d mm -hmm. And that's why you're my bitch. Period. Come on. Shut up, man. I don't know. Nobody is sleeping with my ex, sleeping with my aunt. Um, man, and I'm not getting revenge eventually one day in some way and somehow. So, yeah, I just think they both play games. That's all.